Good afternoon, Madam Chair and members of the Finance Committee. Thank you for having me today. My name is Aidan Skass, and I'm here on behalf of the Chamber of Progress. Make sure you can hear me. Um, I'm here on behalf of Chamber of Progress, a tech industry coalition promoting technology's progressive future, and I'm here to urge you to support and be favorable towards SB 998, which will regulate earned wage access services. The earned wage access industry has several business models. One is employer integrated, which generally allows employees to receive their paychecks earlier from their employer. Another model is direct to consumer, where a third party service provider provides funds to the consumer without direct involvement from the employer. In both models, an EWA provider allows users to access anywhere between 50 to 100% of their earned wages at any given time. We are strong supporters of providing consumers with better alternatives to predatory lending and junk fees at banks. Earned wage access services help workers bridge the gap from today to payday and freeze workers from depending on the payroll cycle and financial system that frequently disadvantages them. Based on a survey conducted by three direct-to-consumer EWA service providers, an overwhelming number of EWA consumers said they understood how the service structure works and consider it the best option to manage their spending. EWA provides consumers the opportunity to stretch their dollar further than the standard two-week pay cycle. The cost of living in Maryland is 16% higher than the national average, and when it comes to basic necessities such as food and clothing, groceries are around 6% higher than in the rest of the country. In this post-COVID inflationary economy, the usage of EWA has increased across the board. From 2018 until now, these services tripled in usage in response to consumers adapting to a financial environment where they are empowered to spend without lack of liquidity. Thank you for your leadership in promoting responsible policymaking for earned wage access with SB 998. This bill will help ensure that Maryland consumers, businesses, and the broader economy will thrive in the emerging fintech economy. Thank you.